What's up, everybody? It's your boy Uchi, and um, back again. Once again, how y'all doing today? It is time for another Pokemon Generations reaction. I know this one's a little bit on the late side, only because a holiday kind of got in the way and kind of delayed things a little bit, but that's all right. We are here now. We are here with another reaction. This is episode 14, The Frozen World, and I see my man Chorus chilling on the thumbnail. So without a further ado. <sighs> It's reaction time! Oh, you, my head, my headphones are. <laughs> All right, here we go. Episode fourteen. Okay. I like the city. Looking good. Oh. Okay. Already we got some catastrophe going on. Alright. Looking like we in Gen 5. Still in the Innova region. With that Lyperd. Whoa. Alright, yep. We're definitely still in Gen 5. Yo, that looked like... Oh! Oh, my man. Ooh, he's back. Nah, y'all about to get got. <laughs> Yo, this is so epic. Wow. Yo. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, that's crazy. All right, show me some. There goes Colrus. Get ready to fire the Curum Cannon. The Curum Cannon. This oh. approach may be lacking. Oh no! Yo, this this whole building about to explode, man. What are you doing, just standing there? Damn. Oh, uh, who are we about to see? White or black, Curum? I'll have. He's about to freeze the whole John. Wow. Everybody frozen. Everybody frozen. Who wants some ice pops? Nah, it's a terrible time for that. <laughs> Let's head back now. Oh my god. So they're about to just dip. Yo, my man's face is definitely warm with all that that face fur right there. Alright, so definitely a pretty solid episode, I would say. Got to see a really interesting part of Gen 5 in this episode. With that being said, the past couple episodes have been Gen 5. It's safe to assume that episode 15, possibly even 16, will be taking place in Gen 6. Look forward to that. I'm looking forward to it. Gen 5 wasn't always my favorite generation, but you know what? Seeing these episodes, I feel like at some point I might want to revisit those games. Unless we do get black and white remakes in the future for the Switch or for 3DS or even future handheld consoles, Nintendo still decides to do that. Gen 5 story was, some, was a story that when I played the game, I wasn't really fond of. And I'm not gonna lie, I didn't really pay too much attention because of how uninterested I was playing those games. But seeing them brought to life in Pokemon Generations is like a whole new way of seeing what actually went down. And I gotta revisit this story. For the sake of the story, and because I love Pokemon, like, it, I, it only truly deserves that much. You know what I'm saying? So, with that being said, let me know what y'all thought about this episode of The Frozen World Pokemon Generations Episode 14 in the comments below. Like, share, subscribe. Hit me up on Twitter. Let me know what y'all thought. And in case you guys haven't been aware, I have been streaming Pokemon Sun and Moon on my Twitch. The Twitch link is in the description as well. 
please follow me there so that way you are notified when exactly i go live i should be streaming like throughout the, the duration of the week i'm basically at the end of the game i'm trying to complete my pokedex so right now i'm at 50 percent so i got halfway to go let's see if i can get to 75 by the end of the week so see me on twitch and check my twitter just to know exactly when i'll be on stream i'll see you guys later